And a warm welcome to the Zignal Iduna Park. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Bundesliga. It is Borussia Dortmund against Wolfsburg. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. This is the lineup for Dortmund. Niklas Zule starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks. Jude Bellingham starts with Emre Can in central midfield. And the striker of choice is the powerful and lethal Sebastian Allaire. And a look at the starting 11 for Wolfsburg. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated, and it could be difficult for them. Good work from Wolfsburg to win the ball back. Well, Marco Reus, usually a potential match winner. Stuart, what are your expectations regarding his performance today? Well, he's the most creative player on the field. He can run with the ball, he can get himself out of tight situations, he can see a pass, he's very creative with his play. I think he's going to be the outstanding player today. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. Yep, he's not putting his full weight on that foot at the moment because he actually got trodden on in the last challenge. Keep an eye on this one. Cheers, Jeff. Well, good clean catch by the keeper. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Wonderful chance. Well, quite simply not precise enough from that position. Jude Bellingham. Emre Jan. Allaire. Who can he pick out? Can he put them in front? Oh no! And the referee doesn't hesitate. That is a spot kick. This to make it 1 0. In it goes! A well taken penalty. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? <laughs> Waldschmidt. And he read it well defensively. Dortmund have been awarded the free kick by the referee. Royce. Now he must favour the cross. Able to clear the danger. Corner kick though here. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, able to close down the short. Inching towards half-time, Borussia Dortmund with the advantage. Your thoughts on what they've put into the game? Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going in at half-time if it stays like this. Says Royce. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. 
Mecha. He's in with a chance. Oh, a good diving save. Now sending it in. And still dangerous. Well, nothing comes of it. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. Crossed accurately towards the far post. Well, it was a menacing attack, but tidied up. And with that, the sound of the half-time whistle. Well, advantage Dortmund after the first 45 minutes, but a long way from the issue being settled. And in the perfect position to read it. Well, Marco Reus, frequently inspirational, and this game is no exception, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get... Really good timing stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. Here it is now, a substitution. Elects to go short. Played into the centre. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. Well, Dortmund just can't dominate the possession but when they have won it back in midfield areas their counter-attacking has been excellent they'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment oh good work by the keeper trying to deliver it accurately and the danger is averted Paolo Ottavio has it. Good looking sequence. And played in. Well, not the best clearance. Guerrero. Well, will the cross work out for them? Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Royce. Big chance. Here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper in his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Well, running room in the wide position. Magnificent challenge to win it back. And out of play, the pass nearly worked out, but not quite. Just cutting off the supply. Svanberg. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Now that pass easy on the eye, and good work to deny the chance. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. Taken short. Arnold. And using his body to good effect. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Good use of advantage for Dortmund. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Advantage, Borussia Dortmund. 
And that one.